a forehead retina system. In our information-intensive society, the amount of visual information is increasing rapidly, and the visually impaired are facing ever greater obstacles in their everyday lives. There have been numerous proposals to restore the sense of sight by surgical means. Direct stimulation to the visual cortex by an electrode matrix is a well-known example. However, these technologies are not yet mature and may require at least a decade to be put to practical use. On the other hand, there have also been many works on sensory substitution, in which visual information is converted to tactile or oral information. However, none have become widely used for two reasons. One is the technicalities of stimulation. For tactile devices using a large number of mechanical actuators, the system becomes heavy, expensive, and requires a considerable amount of power. The other reason concerns the region of stimulation. Many previous proposals put vibration motors on the waistcoat to stimulate the skin on the back. It is surely wearable, but it is not as facile as most successful carry-on devices such as eyeglasses or cell phones. At SIGGRAPH 2003, we presented Smart Touch, which was a visual to tactile conversion system for skin on the finger using electrical stimulation. The user touches a thin plate which has a 4x4 matrix of electrodes on one side and the same number of optical sensors on the other side. The device allows people to feel surface visual information by tactile modality. We now proceed to the next stage by proposing what we call a forehead retina system, or FRS. A small camera mounted on a pair of sunglasses captures the view in front. Outline edges are extracted and converted to tactile sensation by electrical stimulation. 512 electrodes, or 32 by 16, are arranged at a 3 mm interval and driven sequentially to present rich 2D information. Compared to previous vision substitution systems, the electrical stimulation method is lightweight, cheap, scalable, and consumes much less energy. At the same time, since the forehead is used as a stimulation point, it is much easier to put on and to take off, while coordinate system transformation taking place in our brain is much more developed for our heads than for other parts of the body. FRS enables visually impaired persons to effectively see objects without touching them directly.